back to my channel. For those of y'all who don't know me, my name is Crystal. And for those of y'all who are subscribed, please, and showing me love and support. Thank you, thank you so much. I really, really, truly appreciate it. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to achieve this uh, makeup look. Now, this makeup look, I did it um, for the back to school. Again, it's a little bit on the dramatic side, but who doesn't want to go dramatic on the first day of school? You know, you're trying to impress and all that stuff. So this is this look is mostly for high schoolers. Um, some middle schoolers might be able to rock off this look. It's up to y'all. Um, I did a little of a pinkish kind of tonish um, lip gloss, but it can go as well with a nude gloss or a nude um, lipstick and it will be as perfect as it can be. Uh, so it can be like a little bit more flirty and natural. So if y'all want to know how I achieve this look, please keep on watching. Okay guys, so let's get started on this beautiful look. So since it is a back to school look, I do want to, since it's going to be the first day obviously, I do want it to be like out there and you know like oh yeah she looks so good whatever um mostly on the first day when we like to when we like to show off people uh, to people so that's what i'm going to try to go for but keep it in mind it's still for school so i'm going to do it kind of like soft but out there you know what i mean so i'm going to start off And this is perfect for um, either middle schoolers. I don't know. I mean, I wouldn't technically say middle schoolers, but some middle schoolers do go all like, you know, to school. So, I mean, if you're one of those people. Yeah. All right, guys, so my brows are on and I already primed my eyelids. So we're going to go ahead and go in with eyeshadow. Now, I do want to do... Um, a soft tr transition shade. So I'm going to go in with this color right here. It's called Epic from my Pure Festival palette. I'm going to go in to the crease with that color. And we're going to go in softly. Make sure we get that softly. And that's going to be our transition shade. Okay, that's going to be our transition shade. I'm going to blend it in on both sides. Okay, now that I have it blend in on both sides, I'm going to go ahead. I don't know why this brow looks weird for some reason. But we're going to work with it. So now that we have it um, blend out in the crease, I'm going to go in with a different brush with my um, Morphe M44, M441 or M440, I don't know. Can't really even see that brush. And I'm going to take in this brown or like this dark brown, it's called All Night. It's from the same palette, but if you take a lot of this color, it does, um, show off like a lot so i'm going to try and to get a little bit and buff it out like blend it in really good so it can still be soft but a little pop of color you know what i mean so we're going to go ahead and do that so softly buff out all the excess powder and we're gonna go in to the crease with that color as well now remember we want to do it softly but you can see like i didn't grab any much because we can build up the color so we can just keep building up the color um softly we don't have to go in with harsh like you know dark line no that's not gonna look cute so we want to go in softly with that color it doesn't matter if you go down into the eyelid because we're going to 
conceal that part and make our cut crease, okay? So just make sure you do it softly, blend it in pretty well, just like so. Okay, and now um, I'm going to go in with the same brush that I did the first transition shade and just keep blending without adding any powder just so we don't have any harsh lines, okay? So that's what I'm gonna do without adding any powder, I mean, sorry, any product at all. Okay, so I'm just gonna blend and minimize those harsh lines and blend those two colors together. Okay, now that we have both colors blended and ready to go, I'm going to go ahead and um, create the cut crease. Like I said, this is going to be like a really simple, easy look because you know when you wake up in the mornings, sometimes you oversleep or whatever because you know who wants to go, who wants to start waking up in a routine when you were just sleeping all, all freaking summer. So we're going to do it nice and simple and easy to do. So that's why I did only two colors on my crease. Now we're going to go in and cut the crease. And again, I'm gonna be using my Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. As you can see, this line right here is where you can see the actual tube, which means I'm running out. Which means I'm not happy about that, okay? So I'm just going to go ahead and start cutting the crease like normal let's start cutting this crease now this crease is going to be a little bit different because i'm going to bring it out to towards the outside of the lid and you guys will see why okay so i'm just going to be applying this color enchantress on my lid and it's for my butter london palette Okay, now that I have that color on in there, I'm going to go in with, I'm going to try, because I really don't have a glitter liner, so hopefully it comes out good, um, with uh, my Stila um, eyeshadow, liquid eyeshadow thing, and it's in the color Diamond Dust. focuses oh it's never gonna focus by the way my family's here so that's a noise that you're hearing in the background i'm sorry okay so let's start so i'm just gonna put it on the crease where we cut the crease i'm just gonna do it all the way so let's see Now we're going to do eyeliner. Okay, so there you go. My liner. And let's do the other eye and I'll be right back.
Okay, guys, so I already have my eyeliner on both of my eyes, and my glitter liner as well. Okay, so I'm gonna go in with my foundation now. All over my face. Okay, so now we're gonna go in with some concealer under our eyes, on our nose, forehead, cupid's bow. And let's blend. I hate this part when my lips look like I'm dead. Yep. So I really don't know what was wrong with my brow earlier in the video. This one was looking a little crazy, but I think it looking it's looking better. So now we're gonna blend under our eye. I need a mirror for this. Okay, I'm going to put a little bit of eyeliner under my eye just because I like that. Um, ow. I like that dramaticness. Just like so. And we're going to contour our face. So we can bring color to our face. So let's just start contouring. I forget the name. Highlighter. Some highlighter. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah. I'm going to curl my lashes and apply mascara. Okay, now some people don't like wearing lashes and that is totally fine. I accept that. So, some people don't like wearing lashes and that's okay. That's totally fine. Um, I like wearing lashes because I just applied mascara. And you can barely see my lashes and I don't like that. So, since I'm dramatic... Why not add some lashes, you know? It's going to be the first day of school either way. And you're going to see new people. And why not? Just tell me. Why not wear lashes? Alright guys, so that looks way much better with lashes. My glue hasn't dried yet. But it's getting there. Um, so I love how it looks with lashes. So now I'm going to let my lashes dry but i'm gonna apply something to my lips you know what i'm gonna, I'm gonna apply this one let me see how it looks
Okay. This. Tr so I went with this kind of like red, pinkish. I don't know how to explain it type of look. Um, I like it, but some people might think it's too much. That's fine. You can just go with like a nude lip or like a subtle, more subtle look on the lip, which is totally acceptable. Now, the last thing before I forget is apply mascara to my upper and lower lashes okay and i am officially done with this look and this is how it looks so keep in mind my eyelash glue might still be kind of wet that's okay it's gonna dry but look at this okay guys so hope you like this look Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really appreciate the love and support. Again, like I said, I'm so sorry about the background noise. Uh, they're still working in my house, but I just didn't want to quit uploading videos. So please comment down below the next video you would like to see. And I hope I see you guys soon next time. And please, if you haven't done so, comment, like, and subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to turn on that notification bell to get notified when my next video is up. I hope you guys have a great and amazing day. I love you guys so, 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 so much. Thank you all for the love and support.